you were looking at brand new Modern Warfare 2 gameplay from the single player campaign that we're going to be breaking down as there are some very cool details. This gameplay comes with a very exciting announcement as today it's officially confirmed that campaign early access is happening for Modern Warfare 2, meaning a full week before the launch on October 20th, if you digitally pre-order the game, you will be able to play the full campaign. This means when you get your hands on the game, you won't need to decide what to play first. You'll be able to dive into the campaign a full week before, fully explore everything that it has to offer before the game launches on October 28th. The campaign features missions in Europe, Asia, and the Americas, and is set to be an incredible experience on numerous levels with offshore sieges with underwater combat, all out explosive assaults from 30,000 feet above enemy strongholds, and high stakes, low profile stealth missions in both plain sight and under the cover of darkness. Now we only get a 30 second trailer of brief snippets of campaign but this is all stuff we have never seen before and it looks absolutely incredible. I would argue that up until now what we've seen so far hasn't been overly impressive but you can definitely see a stark visual difference in how the new modified engine looks for this game with parts of this looking like a movie and this is exactly what we've been wanting to see especially in these shots here where we can see our player character on the top of a skyscraper about to rappel down it. It just looks incredibly real. Now we have to talk about the opening shots with Soap running towards cover, holding a very peculiar sniper rifle. Now we all want the intervention to return back in this game as it would only make sense as it's Modern Warfare 2. But upon closer inspection, it looks like the MSR from Modern Warfare 3. But if I'm mistaken, please correct me in the comments or if it's neither of those weapons and something completely different, let us know as well. But the vibrancy and the colors throughout this just look absolutely gorgeous. Especially if we go to 19 seconds here where we're walking down a very dark alleyway where it looks very reminiscent to me of Clean House from Modern Warfare 2019, which is easily one of the best missions in Call of Duty history. But to be getting similar vibes from that is absolutely awesome. You can see another shot from this mission taking place in this vibrant city skyscraper at night where Price is busting his way through this employee's only door. And you can really see the details here in his outfit and even the hairs on his arm. Like this is the sort of thing where you can really tell a big difference in how amazing the engine upgrade is. Before it ends with a shot that can only be described as all gillied up. 2.0. We have had descriptions already that there are going to be similar stealth missions to all gillied up in this game, but just seeing a ghillie suit lying there in the big tall grass with ghillie weed on the sniper makes me really, really excited. Now, who could that be? Well, it could only be one person, of course, and it is Soap McTavish, as we see in this screenshot here. Now, I'd love to know your thoughts in the comments below about the fact that we're getting campaign a whole week early, but that is fantastic news because no longer do have to decide on what mode we want to play first. We can all focus on getting the campaign completed, enjoying everything that is going to be within that campaign before we jump over to the full launch for multiplayer and whatever else they have in store for us. Now, we also have an official road to launch roadmap of the important dates you need to know when it comes to Modern Warfare 2. But just before that, a very quick message. Let me ask you this. Have you always wanted to create YouTube content but don't know how? Well, thanks to my good friend who I'm sure you all know, Mr. Tlexify. It's been hard at work to create a brand brand new website service called edit.tv where you can hire an editor who's worked with popular creators that specifically understands how to edit for the YouTube algorithm and get your content viral. Now on the website, you can hire an editor on a leaderboard designed to provide the best freelancers who'll create your content. And you can search for videos or thumbnail artists using the search bar to narrow down the YouTube editor you want or to sign up to be the editor that you want. And if you want to edit videos, then it's very easy to apply on the website. If you've got editing experience and want to edit other people's videos, it's super easy to apply on the website. It's a premium service as well for unlimited limited orders on the website. I think it's such a fantastic idea. But the idea of this platform is that anyone can find a great editor and have great content created to help grow your channel. So check it out in the link below. Super proud of Lex for creating this. And I hope you guys find it useful. But let's get back to the video. So the road to launch starts with the Call of Duty next event in September in LA, which I will be attending. So I will be bringing you guys exclusive multiplayer gameplay as well as live streaming it here on the channel. So we've got you all covered then. And then the very next day for four days will be the first 
first weekend of the beta, which is PlayStation exclusive. So not long to wait at all after seeing multiplayer to get your hands on it. Then when week one ends just two days later, beta weekend two will kick off on all platforms with crossplay enabled, which will be really, really cool. And I can't wait to get my hands on the PC version because that's when we'll be able to see just how beautiful the game really can be. And then within a month of that, we get campaign early access on the 20th of October, which is only for digital pre-orders. So I have to stress, if you haven't pre-ordered this game digitally, you won't be able to get campaign early access. It's only for digital. And then a full eight days later, the game will launch worldwide. We're able to get our hands on everything. But next month is when we're going to be learning everything about the game. We'll be seeing multiplayer gameplay. The multiplayer reveal tons of details regarding the game, as well as info on the next Warzone and more info on the mobile version of Call of Duty Warzone. It'll be a multi-hour event with the reveal, streamers such as myself playing the game in real time, and there will be even more redacted information and surprises, which we'll be covering here on the channel as well. Very, very exciting stuff. And man, the campaign looks absolutely phenomenal. I cannot wait. Let me know what you think down below, and I'll catch you for another video soon.